almost to wrap time now. More ghouls to boot. Prepare for battle, Bloom. Nice shot, Boone. I say I'm running through this ammunition a little faster than I would like. Same could be said for the durability of this weapon. Not more. Alright, boom. Let's make our way inside. This way, boom. Bear trap. Yes, this goes upstairs. More fools. Well, these are wearing. Uniform of sorts. Fine by me. Real hungry. Probably a steak. Fine by me. Alright. Nothing. Let's keep moving. Fine by me. Fine by me. See what I can do about preparing them. Might be able to sell them for a tidy profit. Nice shot. I'm gonna have to get myself a rifle like yours. Especially given how fast I'm carrying through ammunition with this rifle. Hmm. Got something to say, Boone? What is it? Nothing for now, although we should talk with talk yeah. later. Can't run from me. All right, right smooth skin. I'm letting you in. 
You better watch yourself. I'll sure as hell be watching you. Alright. Yes. Is that it? God, but are you ugly? Get upstairs and talk to Jason before I throw up just from looking at you. Hey, you're not cool. Your pranks won't work on me, Smooth Skin. They won't work on Jason either. Smooth Skin? Your skin looks pretty smooth to me. Stop wasting my time, Smooth Skin. Go waste Jason's. Alright. Upstairs it is. Jason. Hello, Wanderer. Please forgive us our humble surroundings. Our true home awaits us in the far beyond. Have you come to help us complete the great journey? I'm here because feral ghouls have been wandering into Novak. And they've been shooting them down like animals, haven't they? Those ghouls were members of my flock, even after the madness consumed their minds. We never let them wander free. We kept them safe on the first floor. We kept them contained. The demons must have let them out. Somehow. And now they are lost forever. Denied the salvation and healing glow of the far beyond. Please, Wanderer. Bear in mind that every feral ghoul you spare now is one that we can save later. Once the way is clear, our feral brothers and sisters will accompany us on the great journey. If there are any left. Tell me about these demons. The demons appeared from nowhere. Except it might be more accurate to say they never actually appeared at all. The demons are invisible. Where one of them stands, the most one sees is the air shimmering like sunlight on water. They set upon us as we were on our way to worship one morning. We had just entered the basement. My flock fought bravely, and killed a few, but at such cost. Nearly half of us died, or went missing. The rest of us retreated up here. One of the demons raved at us, but they have not tried to attack us since. Still, their demonic presence brought all progress towards the great journey to a standstill. But now you have come. Once again, the Creator has sent a human to help us across a seemingly insurmountable obstacle. Say one of the demons raved at you? Yes, over the intercom. Threats of death should we step outside. Guarantees of safety should we stay locked away. It went on for hours, and did not always make sense. But that was the first day only. Since then, silence. Will you drive away the demons, Wanderer? I'll take care of these demons for you. Praise the Creator! Bless you, Wanderer! Bless us all! As soon as the Underground has been rid of demons, preparations for the Great Journey can resume. Alright, Boone. Looks like we got super mutants with stealth boys. Based on what we've seen, we prefer close quarters combat. Should probably switch to armor piercing rounds. But, um. Let's see if they have a leader who we can talk and reason with. That would certainly be preferable. Dark in here. If you want to use a scope, I can spot you. Keep you on target. Let's see what 
that's in here. What's that, Adler? We have a visitor. An assassin, more like. I say kill it, Adler, for safe sake. Hmm? Okay, Adler, I'll ask. Uh, hi, human. Why you come here? Um, I came here on behalf of the ghouls upstairs. A human who is friend to ghouls? Suspicious. You meet the ones upstairs. Antler used intercom, told them stay put, but they want to come down in basement anyways. I cannot allow. My kin are not right in head like I am. They attack you on sight. Ghouls too. They crazy. Your cool friends have to wait until you find what Antler brought us to get. Um... Maybe I can help then. Good. Antler brought us here for a reason. Why was that, Antler? Right. A, a piece of paper. Shipment invoice. Hundreds of stealth boys sent here a, a long time ago. But stealth boys must be in the one room. One we don't search yet. The one we can't search. Why can't you search this last room? A ghoul, but not squishy like others. This ghoul is tough. I thought Antler said, send my kin into that room, but three died. Ghoul is a crack shot and set traps too. After I realized, I heard Antler wrong, so I locked the door to keep kin out and wait for Antler to tell me what to do. Then you come along. Antler says you are solution. I'll find the stealth boy stockpile for you if your kin will leave this place. Yes, Antler says we leave here as soon as we get stealth boys. Let me give you key. Antler had me lock the door. The ghoul inside, not expecting a human. Maybe he don't shoot you. Maybe he will. Alright. I'm Boone. Let's talk to this ghoul. That's assuming the knight can don't find us first. We're still cool? That's good. Come and get it, you big dumb. Hey, you're not one of those things out there. Who the hell are you? Jason sent me down here to get rid of the demons. And I bet he told you it's the creator's will for you to risk your ass instead of him, right? Well, good luck with that. I'd give you a hand, but no thanks. I may look like a corpse, but I'm partial to living. <laughs> well, how do you get trapped down here? First off, I'm not trapped. This was a tactical choice, all right? I'm no match for those things out there. So I found a good defensive position, and I've been defending it, right? Oh, who am I fooling? I'm trapped. Name's Harland. Pleased to meet you. What happened was, I was escorting folks down to work when those things attacked us. Most of the fight was upstairs, but some folks panicked and made for the basement, and I went after them. Well, turns out there were even more of those bastards down here than upstairs, and things went to shit fast. I couldn't find the others, so I fell back to this room, set up a nice little kill zone. End of story. You don't look like the other ghouls from Wright's group. Guess the outfit gives that away, huh? I never did buy into that religious mumbo-jumbo with the robes and all that shit. It gets lonely out in the wastes, okay? And I don't have to tell you that Bright's group has got some fine-looking goulettes in it. Huh. Or maybe I would have to tell you. Anyway, I helped them out, and they kept me supplied with ammo and pleasant company. How can I get you out of this room? Huh. Well, you're polite. I'll give you that. If this was just between you and me, I'd do as you ask. But it's not. 
I had a friend with me when those mutant bastards came out of nowhere. She panicked and ran the wrong direction. Further into the basement. She's probably dead. But I ain't leaving until I know for sure. I'd have gone looking myself. Except that wouldn't last a minute out there. You, on the other hand, seem pretty resourceful. Find my friend, and I'll get out of your way. I'll try to find your friend. Thanks. Let me know what you find out. Here's hoping she's okay. Moon, stay here. I have an idea. I'll sit. Help him defend this hole. Put that stealth boy to use. See if we can get down there. That's about as far down as you can get in this basement. It looks like. And real hungry though. Let's have a grilled mantis. I haven't had one of those yet. Let's hope we don't need any super mutants on the way back up. Nothing. Anything else down here? Such a shame I had to use all my armor piercing ammo in one place.
That was close. I've got you. Did you find my friend? As a matter of fact, I did. I see. Well, spare me the details. Damn it. I'm gonna miss that crooked yellow smile. All right. You did your part, so I'll do mine. Look around up here if you want. I'm gonna make a break for topside. Good luck. Uh, traps too. Be careful, Boone. Here's a terminal. Maybe I'll have the information for me. aren't here. We'll have to, uh... Oh! Hell. I have a doctor's bag. As a matter of fact, I do. I think I want to use a stim pack now. Maybe two. It's better. Antler sings for stealth boys. Have you found them? There's no stock stockpile of stealth boys in this building. Liar! The envoy said stealth boys here. Antler read it out loud to me. The stealth boys were sent here by mistake, then sent back. But invoice note said stealth boys were here. Why can't that note be true? What, Antler? But human could be lying. He's stealing the stealth boys for itself. Oh, Antler, you trust so easy. Your lucky day, human. Antler, believe you. Nikon will follow the new note to find stealth boys. Better be there. I'll get out of your way then. Boon, I have his way. I'm out here.
glad to see Harlan made it back up here. You did good, smooth skin. Never thought I'd get out of that room. See it later. Oh, here it goes. 